I'm not sure how well my computer is going to handle it. We will see. All right, we, we, are, we are live. Why am I I'm here, hearing myself right now? All right, we're on? Yeah, we're on. All right, I'll, I'll go ahead and uh, – did anybody join in yet or no? All right, so everybody that's in the uh, the uh, silent stream right now, um, I actually started up a separate hangout with Jesse, which I know is kind of weird, but um, – so it's actually – there's actually a separate stream going on with Jesse at the moment. Um, I, there is a way for me to share my desktop audio, but whatever. It's just, it wasn't working right. Okay, so Jesse, what are y'all doing this morning? This is our little staging area right before the uh, the lake, which is back there. Is this coming through okay? Yeah, mm -hmm. it's coming through. So we're doing a few things. Um, I'm going to mount this. Uh, I'm going to mount this receiver near to. Um, the dandy's gimbal mounted camera. He's getting it set up right now. Hold on one second, Jesse. Yeah, go ahead. Okay, so if for everybody in the silent stream right now, there's actually a Google Hangout separate stream on my channel right now. Where I'm talking to Jesse, so you can hear me, but you can't hear Jesse most likely. So go ahead, Jesse. Oh, they can't hear me? There's two different streams going on, guys. Okay. <laughs> I got a stream coming from from the We've P, got a lot of different things coming and I've got, <laughs> Yeah, hold on. Let me let me send a link to everybody. Hold on a second. Okay. Scott. All right. That's the link. I just put it in the live chat for the silent stream, and I'm going to mute the silent stream. Go it's over to that made. hangout for the for the moment. Let's get the gimbal mount right between them. Right, yeah. There we go. Okay. So now I've muted the silent stream. So there we go. All right. And I'm going to project, or I'm going to present you guys. There we go. Okay. You guys are up. Okay. So I'm here with Dandy, and Dandy can give you a rundown on his uh, invention. <laughs> yeah. Go ahead. So it's got two of the three axes working right now. See how that's going to work. So that can be controlled from the side of the car. And um, I lost, I lost the uh, what is that yaw or pit? I don't remember. Whatever it is, that's the one I lost. So as soon as we get done at the. Uh, at the center crossover on the causeway, I'm gonna run to uh, Home Depot and get some stuff to fix it, and then I'll make a really good run. So, so this is a test run, really. Yeah, test run. I'm using my camera, so I don't uh, <laughs> mess yours up. <laughs> Just in case there's a catastrophic failure. Right now it's kind of, uh, explain to explain to everybody else that's watching what this is. Wait, I'm doing this. It's wrong. a three-axis gimbal. So, what am I? Oh, I got this facing the wrong way. Right. So from from inside the car, I can mount, you know, as many cameras can fit to this plate, or I can mount another plate to it, and it's all just made out of really heavy duty steel. The only thing aluminum on it is that plate that the uh, camera mounts to, and you can put dampeners in between there and whatnot. And um, yeah, so that's how that works. And um, and what's your goal for today, Dandy? What's the observation you're trying to make? Well, I'm gonna start from the uh, the South Shore and drive to the north, and um, just keep the New Orleans skyline in focus as best I can, and then go back and try to pull all the best frames out of it that are in focus and uh, you know composed properly, and hopefully be able to see the. Uh, the skyline rise and fall over the horizon. The further or closer away, if you run the video forward or reverse, 
So I might make a GIF out of it. I don't know. I don't even know what it's going to look like. So I've never seen it done. I'll we'll have to see. And so when I heard that uh, Dandy was doing this, I offered to mount one of these receivers near to and, and get the uh, relationship of the location of this to his camera. Also, we'll have the height uh, down to the road, so he'll be making a separate profile, uh, you know, that we'll also be able to use. But we're going to have the time tag of the raw GPS file, the time tag and position of where his pictures are being taken. So we'll be able to synchronize that stuff later on. And, and Jesse, uh, Jesse, are you guys going to the center crossover right now? Yeah, we're going to head there. But while we're, while we're going, we're going to be doing a profile. Gotcha. So just like I did last night, I'll be doing it again. Last night I used uh, GPS only. Today I'm going to use the combination of Russian GLONASS and GPS just for a different data set. Nice. So, all right, fantastic. All right, we'll sign off now and get this all ready to go, and uh, we'll check back with you as we're starting yeah uh, certainly when we get when we get to the crossover we'll uh get a hold of you and do some yeah. video out there as well you know for people to see what we're doing i hope to get the uh the total station set up out there as well once we're out there all right cool and all right so what, i'm gonna try I'm gonna and uh some... i'm gonna try and work out the technical aspect of uh sharing my desktop audio so that we can put it all in the same stream it's loud out here so i can't really hear you but um it's okay yeah it's just... loud yeah, just just uh, call me back when you guys get there. And so, I think I think Mike's actually headed your direction as well. He's going to be going out to the center crossover. Okay, good. All right, alrighty. So I'll right. probably just I'll follow you. Okay. Okay. See you all, all right, later. See you guys. Bye. Bye. Thanks, everybody. I'll try and get the uh, audio set up on the mainstream for the next one.